Hello, 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 hello! Tuto here coming in the guys search bar to bring you another video of War on the Sea. A bit of a heads up. Um, recording and getting videos out is more than likely, well, most likely will become very spotchy coming this coming week and especially next week because. Oh my god, the amount of overtime that work is going to be piling on me and the rest of Swing Shift is a lot. So expect, I'll try and get videos out as normally as I can, but just in case I go a day or hell two days without uploading a video, that's why. And then after that, there should be no more hiccups other than the usual, technically no video on... Thursday, uh, Wednesday, because normal overtime nights. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. Hey, we got ourselves a yawn. <laughs> Anywho, right here is a Yamato class battleship with two heavy cruisers. Er, yeah, two heavy cruisers now. Now, I would love. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I would love to get a battleship duel with this. I, it would be awesome. It would make the fucking day. However, they're going this way. And I think, but I think, and they're heading this way towards Guadalcanal. Or Andros heading towards Task Force 81, which has no hope of standing up against the Yamato. At all. So here's what I am hoping. I'm hoping I can get this fleet spotted and trick or force the AI to come out and engage the fleet. That might not happen. If it seems like they're going to catch up and hit Task Force 81, which I'm going to start pulling back to Guadalcanal. Or it looks like they if they pass... Here's the thing, if they go to bombard Guadalcanal, that's a Yamato, it's going to take Guadalcanal down a peg. And we need to get this to level 5 in order to win. So I'm moving my carriers into position. If it looks like, uh, if it looks like that they're not going to turn around to engage this fleet, or it looks like this fleet will not catch it, it's going to be a no holds bars. I'm going to be sending literally every freaking plan I have that way. This strike is still going to go off. Because unfortunately, there's 16 torpedoes. I don't think oh, well, all of them are definitely not going to hit. And I don't think all of them are going to fucking work. So. Hard way that to you. 16, 16. Okay, well, we have a lot more torpedoes. Some of them, I'll have some of these probably go for the cruisers. Ah, up here. And we gotta deal with our regu regular, 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 regulatory fighter uh, bugginess. Oh, and I moved off, uh, A, I moved off the, um, Beta and B got the sound rod back, so that should be fun. Uh, I need you to go over here, and I need somebody to keep a freaking eye on these ships. Okay, well, good news. This ship was spotted. This fleet had to have been spotted, and it's been most likely been spotted by one of the fleets over there, which I will set in this fleet to go deal with. I don't actually, now I think about it, because they're spotted. Uh, shit. Yeah, 
Okay, we're gonna get some aircraft up and we're gonna get more over here. Oops, fuck. Whatever. I'll do quick. Uh nothing. Great. Yeah, no, we would have spotted him. Okay, well, this is fun. I just lost contact with a fucking Yamato. How do you lose a goddamn Yamato? It's a Yamato, for Christ's sakes. How do you lose it? Oh, this is just great. Sucks. Okay, battle can operate to launch aircraft. Cool and all. But where in the unholy hell is the Yamato? Where is that scout plane going? More than likely, Shinano. You're gonna hold your course. Stand by. That way, you guys got a free felt plane. You do Massachusetts. Well, you're you've all been spotted. Go that way. Let's get the fighters a little bit closer. Uh, we're not gonna shoot down the scout scout plane. Nay, in fact, we're gonna follow it home. Uh, you got a scout aircraft? No, I want. Uh, Done and follow that plane up. Thankfully, the AI mostly takes direct routes back to their home plate. So, okay, so there's the two heavy cruisers. Um, I am actually gonna fall back here and I'm gonna use my aircraft still. Why not? Okay, so it looks like we got dive bombers coming into Task Force 71 again. Got it. Fortunately, I'm being forced into these, and I hate that shit because they're dive bombers. But we already know where they're going. So we're gonna head down this way. Board with. You can't launch any aircraft. Uh, Enterprise, you are. You do have aircraft. We're gonna launch again. Twelve. Because those guys are running out of. Uh, what's it called? Fuel. Well, shit. Looks like they're close. They fucking ain't. As unfortunate as that is. Okay, I want to see if I can make this through. I think... I have an idea on how to dodge dive bombers and the AI doing it to me well last episode kind of slightly confirmed it you see turning in sometimes works but it's not guaranteed you might take a bomb hit you might not take a bomb hit Turning away sometimes succeeds. You may take a bomb hit. You might take a few. 
figure out who they're going for. And it looks like it's the Phelps, which makes this a little bit easier. But what the AI did, and was really effective at dodging our bombs, was to zigzag. Turn away, then turn in. Then turn, then turn in and turn away. And that's what it did. And it worked pretty fucking well. well. Maybe you can get that guy. I'm gonna need you guys to speed the fuck up. Well, let's do this pause so I can get them all. to uh, dodge because like there's only two unfortunate that he's on the edge but I'll turn left a little bit turn away Bit, wait for it to die, wait for it to move in. Okay, now left. Ooh, damn! Or just have our flak shoot her ass out of the fucking sky. That works too. That uh works pretty fucking well. Uh, we'll let that float plane go. Okay, then I guess our flak decided to work that day or that time. Yeah, that arrives ready to launch again. Oh, that ain't good. Okay, um, pause. What's the quickest way to get after heading up north? We're gonna try and cut him off. We got nine hours left. I have no idea where the hell she's. I think she's heading towards Halford. And in that case, we're gonna have you start running this way. That is the only reason why she'd be going up there. Good news! Um, she's obviously not gonna bombard Guadalcanal. Bad news, she's going after this force, which is very light on destroyers. Okay. Now I'm about to sneeze like hell. Uh, why'd I launch? Oh. Yeah, there should be cruisers up here. Oh, now that's just too good to pass up. Don't miss. They're more up north, I would say. I 
Seems like I lost contact. Ah, got him. I think. Maybe. I guess not. Okay. Uh, uh, who's free? You're free. Helen, uh, keep an eye on this. Uh, I think it was you. You're also free? No. You're, you can roll your over now. Uh, you're still heading north. Okay. Begin. Start. Retreat. Thank you. Oh, fuck. There was something. There was something else there. Okay, so we, I guess, overshot it. We have to know. There you are. There you are. Hello. Tones, how are you? I have a gift for you. Uh, it is a thousand pounds. Well, hang on. A thousand. So we have a thousand pound bomb per dive bomber in two. 1,000 pound bomb, so that's 1,200 pounds of bombs times 12. Oh, fuck basic math. Well, 1 times 12 is fucking 12. That's 12,000 pounds of bombs. A hundred or 200 times 12. Fuck me. Okay. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty two. I was gonna say twenty four. So two thousand four hundred so that's about fourteen thousand four hundred pounds of bombs. Right. So my math was right, I did it in my head correctly, I just don't wanna pull a fucking gura. And say bad math. So, you know, double checked it with act with doing a deal fashioned way of counting it. Someone doesn't get New Jersey in the Arthur Lane event in our uh, chat. Feels bad for him. He only got San Francisco, and I got them all but San Francisco, but I got plenty of fucking heavy cruisers. So, I mean, I just use Baltimore. I was actually on the battleship New Jersey when I went back east with my uh, father. He took us to the battleship New Jersey. Boy, was that just awesome to be on. Two duds. How dare you miss so many times. 
it was so, but it was, yeah, it was cool. Like, it was huge. And see, as a kid, seeing that shell, those battleship shells, man, those things, I didn't even know, it was like amazing. Oh, this ship's dead. This ship, not so much. She might live, she might not. Yep, kind of expected number two to go dead. Now number one, will you be... At least let me finish. Jesus. But that's obviously a fucking yes. Now the question is, how the fuck am I going to get... I'm going for this battleship duel. We are going to have this battleship duel. Alabama, Massachusetts, and Indiana. At some point, in some way, and somehow, we'll fight this Yamato. Whether I can try and pop off some of her escorts at the same time. Mm, Sixteen. We're gonna lose contact when the float plane goes away. Well, we can give it a shot. Yeah, if you think I'm gonna give a, a Yamato class a fair fight, <gasps> you must be fucking mentally destroyed because I am not giving that ship a fair fight. That ship was designed for an unfair fight. Ooh. Ooh. It's not overkill. Okay, you keep a fucking eye on this thing. Don't let that thing out of your fucking sight. Okay, you're gonna keep an eye on this destroyer. A single solitary destroyer. Let's see if we can figure out what kind of destroyer this may be. Well, I could fucking scout it and figure it out, but with the time... So, it's could be a Monmi. Uh, could be a Minikaze. Uh, can't be a Wakatake. Can't be a Kamikaze. Uh, could be a Mitsuki class. Uh, could be a Fubuki. I'm gonna have to probably weigh heavily on it being a Fubuki since there's two of them left. Can't be a Nakatsuki. Can't be a hair uh has it sure you. Can't be a share it to you. Could possibly be an Ashino class. Can't be a Kagero. Uh could be a Yagumo. There's four of them left, so actually most likely it's most likely a, a Yagumo or a Fabuki class. Uh Oh, ooh. Ah, I need to fix that. Okay. Wow. Oh, boy, am I lucky. You know, Mara, I forgot to put on. Fucking expanded arsenal. I am so lucky. I might have also been, I might have just fucking broken the game engaging in those in that surface action. Let's check. Let, let, let's just check to see if we did this correctly.
Well, that's broken. Maybe. Yeah, that's broken. <laughs> we killed so many, I can't fucking fix that. Okay, um... Well, before... I go any farther... Uh, especially engaging that Yamato, because it could be... Whatever. Uh, let me just go to my thing and get the, uh... things pulled up because that could be a very 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 problematic go to my downloads scroll all the way down to there no that's not it where is it down 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 there it is Yes, shut up, you. Take that. Put that in there. Replace. Okay, now we are going to quickly fucking save this. That was a really good thing I checked that. Yeah, I'll write that. And uh, we are going to do quick, quick. Thank God this game is very quick to quickly close out. And quickly start right back up. Look at that. Look how quick that was. Like, yay, that's awesome. Okay. Now. Here we go. That's fixed. It's a lot of fucking tonnage. Ah, and Shinner. Okay, well, anyways, let's see if we can figure out. Now let's check these destroyers. Well, the only destroyers they added in new were the, uh, that he added in more of was the, uh, uh two keys. Then it could also be a Nakatsuki, but yeah, now I'm gonna go with a Yaguma and a Fabuki, one of the two, because they have. Or it could be an Akatsuki because they have two. I'm going to go with one of those three. Yagumo, Akatsuki, or Fabuki. If I, had to be, if I were a betting man. And most of the time, I'm not. Most of the time, where are the fucking fight? Whatever. Oh. They were out of fuel. Son of a bitch. That one's on me. That one's on me. Okay, fleet. How many are attacking? Four. Not too bad. Now, who are you going for? Uh, San Diego? Bring us up to flank speed. Uh, looks like you're going for... Vendo. A hard left rudder. So we can bring more of the side to bear. Of the fleet. Rudder midships there. So the fleet will turn with, but shouldn't have to turn too hard. The only ships turning really hard are the destroyers they are able to make such a turn. Yeah, they're going for the heavy cruiser. So you're going to break your formation. And you're going to go right over midships. Your evasive maneuvers are going to be a little bit difficult here. And you're going to have to go left and then you're going to have to go right in that destroyer. We're going to preemptively start turning her to the right. Okay. Okay. 
left a little bit more, cause them to turn. Uh, my rudder, my chips. Right full rudder, right full rudder, right full rudder. damage do we got not bad at all and a shit shit ton of luck oh ho, ho, ho. okay well then go deal with the flooding they felt uh, just keep turning in the circle right now. Uh, you're gonna go rudder left. Uh, slow her down to 13 knots. So the, it looks like the best way to do that is to zigzag out, then in, not in, then out. Fortunately, stuff like that is trial and error. <laughs> That's our yeah, yeah. The from the damage, we've only lost a machinery space. So she's still combat effective. We're just gonna slow her down to keep. I'm assuming this works, but the pr the bulk is from breaking, and uh, I see that fire. We can let it sort of burn. We'll send our uh, damage control up there. And then one of these DCs are going straight to the fucking magazine. Oh, I guess that's spread. Okay, that's going up there. Uh, actually, yeah, I deal with the flooding because we now know that flooding can progress. Uh, at least from it looks like from the damage compartments here. I don't think it can spread from these compartments. Unsure. Oh, would you fuck off with the spreading? Two, one, go. Okay, perfect. And this one should be done. Uh, let's get done real quick. Let's speed this shit up. Keep an eye on it. Oh my god, it's fire. You're dealing with that. Okay, perfect, actually. That's not. Okay, so that's not catastrophic. Okay, let's fire it out. That's being repaired, that's being repaired, that's being repaired, and that fire is being fought. I'm gonna wait for these to turn to yellow at the very minimum. Hey, hey perfect. And the fire is out. Just turn to yellow. Yeah, not bad at all. Moderate. Eh, I would say more light damage, not moderate. Whatever floats your boat. I just realized the fucking pun I said. And that was very unintentional. And God damn it! I keep clicking the fucking name thing. That needs to change. They need to change that shit. To be like somewhere over here. Like you click on the goddamn name, not this shit. Cause then it makes it fucking invisible. Which honestly I don't really care. If the name's invisible, it's just fucking... Oh, what the fuck was that? It's just annoying and all. Uh, let's try and get these troops dropped off and let's see if we can get some more, uh, more fighting in here. Yeah, that's... 
I don't know if there's any more air. No, we shot them all down. So, yeah, no. Th this this fleet's safe for now. No, come morning, we're going to have to fucking throw some planes on top of the damn thing. Can you keep them spotted? Please. Okay, come... What is it? 18? It's under rules. Yeah, 1800. Did I just change to 19? No, it's just my eyes being an idiot. Okay. Come 1800, we're gonna launch a float plane that should hopefully stay with her. There you are. What are you? A Fabuki? No! Yes, you are a Fabuki. Okay. How many dive bombers do I want to waste on you? <laughs> I'm not sorry. <laughs> Wrong place. Wrong time. I think we don't listen to video on a um note. One of two things is gonna happen. Either this ship is going to fucking die. <laughs> And I mean fucking die. Or she'll somehow survive this. And if she survives it, if this ship survives this, I will not sink her. I will not sink this ship. Problem is trying to figure out if when it comes to there's two of these ships left. Yeah, I won't finish off the Fubuki class. If you survive this, the Fubuki class gets to live. And I will not shoot him. That's the deal. <laughs> you just got to survive this. Are you up for the challenge? You must choose your maneuvers carefully. Are you even turning? Okay. You must choose your maneuvers carefully. Have you chosen wisely? You have not chosen wisely. Far <laughs> from it. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Keep going, keep going, push it home, push it home. <laughs> oh, you missed a di Wow. Uh, this flight, it sucks. I think we got it, though. Actually, a lot less bombs than I thought would hit her. Still. <laughs> The Fubuki class lost another ship. It's not either doing it this way. Yeah, they only have a uh, a sugar, a sugar left. Uh, are you within range to unload your cargo? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think that's a funny thing to end it on. This is Dude Tall saying thank you for joining me on this Let's Play of War on the Seas. Uh, the Tokyo... The, 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 I will say one thing about the Tokyo Express mod. This is obviously off of an old campaign. But just given how it is and how the Americans are set up... 
the Americans have it a lot easier. Just because... Like the Japanese, my carrier strike aircraft have the range to strike. And, well, my spotting aircraft, I, I surprisingly enough, I get more of them. They're not as good, but more often than not, for this price, at least, I get more of them because of the heavy and light cruisers, like a Brooklyn and all of that. So, yeah, like my light and heavy cruisers carry more float planes and are cheaper. Except for in the Tone's case. But yeah. Like the Japanese are a lot harder to play as. But that's gonna do it for this episode again. This is 2000. Thank you for joining me on Let's Play Warren to See. Stay safe. And as always, have an awesome, awesome day.